Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Simone. I make lifestyle videos and vlogs, but today's video is going to be all about what is in my work bag. And I'm so excited to do this because my work bag is the Samsonite Sarah Jessica Parker collab called the Carried Away Convertible Bag. And this is, it is so beautiful. I did a video review on this maybe a year or two ago, because I've had this bag for a while, geez maybe two years ago and it's held up. And guys, when I did like, let me tell you something, this is crazy. When I did the review, guess who reached out on my Instagram? Sarah Jessica Parker! I don't know why I screamed, but guys look, she sent me a handwritten letter. You see, like guys, she touched this handwritten letter and a bunch of gifts from her store, SJP collection and I cried. I was like, whoa, this bag was meant for me. That situation was meant to happen. And I meant to share this with you guys because this bag is so worth it. So this video will be a mix of like a one year, I don't know how long I've had this, one year update of this bag and a what's in my bag. So like I said, this is the SJP and Samsonite collab carried away convertible bag. I got it in black. This bag is awesome because it's convertible, so you can use it as a book bag with the straps on the back. Um, you can use it as kind of like a tote with this here, and then it also comes with a strap. It's like a neon green strap that the black version comes with that you hook around to the loops here, and it becomes more of like a shoulder bag. You can even do a crossbody. And then it also comes with this little pouch, which I use way more than I thought I would, especially when traveling. Um, that attaches to the bottom of the bag, but you can pull it out and you attach the included straps here to make it a crossbody, or you can hold it as a clutch. So there's so many ways to wear this bag. It's super versatile. I love it, love it, love it. I have literally no complaints. So spoil alert, there are no complaints about this bag, honestly. But I have used it for travel. That's my original reason for buying it because it was like the middle of COVID or the start of the pandemic. I don't know the timeline, it's been a blur. So when I first got this bag and um, I was using it for travel. And then when I started going back to the office, I of course used it to carry my office supplies. I use it if I'm going to spend the night somewhere really quickly. Like it has so many uses, but oh my God, this is the perfect bag. It retails at $199.99 and it comes in a bunch of different colors and they release new styles and colors every so often. But I have the black because it goes with everything. And I don't know, every time I use this bag, I always get questions like, where'd you get that bag? What bag is that? Because it's so beautiful and it's so classic and so versatile. Like I'm telling you guys, this is in my opinion, the best work bag so yeah so let's get into the meat of this what is actually in my work bag so we can start on the outside i have this water bottle I actually got from bsw it's just like a um i guess portable water bottle i think all water bottles are portable but this one's cool because it's collapsible that's the word i was trying to use i have it in this nice green color i feel like olive green and black go together so so well usually i keep my laptop in this laptop compartment here in the back right here um but my laptop's plugged up right now because i'm at home but i also keep my ipad in the back because that's where you're supposed to keep your like larger technology so i have my ipad back there i have the ipad air i think the 2021 version so keep that with my pencil back there and the inside is this nice like teal oh this bag is so colorful and so fun like i love it so let's get into the bigger pocket where I store most of my work bag stuff. There's this mini pocket on the inside here. And in that pocket, I have this reusable tote bag from Ikea because sometimes when I leave work, I use it as time to run errands. Since I'm already out in the city, I will just go shopping and I like to use reusable bags, which is better for the environment. And I just, I like that better than having to throw away plastic or find somewhere to store plastic bags in my house. So it collapses into a little pouch, but it's like a standard size tote that I got from Ikea. It was probably like $2, less than five for sure. 
but um, I've had this for a while and it comes in handy. It's, it, it's super thin, but I will say it's super durable. I've carried a bunch of stuff. I even used this at the, as a beach bag one day. So definitely love this little bag. And you see, you can stuff it into its little pocket and it becomes really, really tiny. Um, in that same pocket is where I keep my AirPods. I have the AirPods Pro. I think these are the ones, AirPods Pro. Um, I just have a little black OtterBox case on my AirPods Pro and it comes with a carabiner clip that I don't really use because I also have my keys in here. I just throw my keys in there and I have the regular AirPods that are dead because I've been using the Pro so much. So maybe I should switch these out. But I have this in a heyday case that I got from Target. Um, my air tag, my car key, and my alarm key. So that's that. Um, next, I have some lotion. You got to have lotion at work because when you wash your hands at work, you do not want to go into a meeting. You're like using your hands and there's are just ashy. That's disgusting. I also have my Ray-Bans. I don't know which model these are, but they're like rose gold. Super, super cute. Um... Yeah, I don't know. I still even have like all the collateral in here. <laughs> but yeah, I always have my sunglasses because it gets sunny in the morning when I drive into work and it's sunny in the evening. I have my wallet. This is a just black card holder, like in a guess a bill wallet um, that I got from Target. It's the brand A New Day. It's super cheap, but I love how clean and classic it looks. I just love like simple, minimalistic designs. That's my thing. Oh, I have my little notebook that I just take quick notes on. I have so many notes in here, but I'm also in the need for another notebook because I'm almost done with this one. But it's just a nice little bullet journal that I use as a notebook. Sometimes I doodle on the front. <laughs> what else is in my bag? Oh, I have a dummy phone because if you don't know, I'm a product manager and I focus on mobile accessories. So phone cases, screen protectors, things like that. So I'm always testing out new accessories. So I have this dummy iPhone 13 Pro that, you know, I just can have on the go. So I'm having like a real phone that I have to keep, like, I don't know, it's like, this is plastic, but it has all the features of a dead phone. So like the buttons work, it has MagSafe, um, the volume buttons work, you know, everything. It's just a dummy phone that I got from one of our vendors that I use to test phone cases and screen protectors on. Ooh, this is one of my favorite things I have in my bag. So this is a simple human mirror. I actually got this for my mom for Mother's Day or Christmas or her birthday, one of those, and she never used it. So I took it back. It comes with this cute case, and then you clip this back on so you can't lose it. But also you stick your finger in this little ring, and then you turn on the light. Oops, didn't work. Why isn't it working? That's so embarrassing, I'm trying to show y'all something. Well, anyways, it, it has a light on it and it lights up and it's really, really good. And it's so dirty right now. Oh, there, there's the light, you can kind of see. Like after lunch, I just go check my teeth, make sure I don't have anything on my face. And yeah, I just turn it off and slide it back in this little pouch. Um, and then I have my little pouch. This is like, small toiletry items. So I have lip gloss. I have more hand lotion. This one's like more scented if I wanna get a little fancy. I have a hair clip, a hair tie, um, some wipes that are probably so dry. I've not used these in like five years. And then like feminine products and this little pouch I found, like someone left this on my desk at work and it was empty. I'm like, was it a gift or did someone leave it on accident? But I'm like, hey, no one claimed it, so I'm using it now. <laughs> Guys, that's all that's in my bag. Other than like my laptop, that would be the only thing in my bag. But yes, that is what is in my work bag 2022. Um, I don't see myself changing anything that's in my bag unless I get like a new job where I have to carry new things. But other than that, this is what's gonna be in my work bag. And it works for me. It's light, it's simple, it's easy. I love this bag so much. I get so excited to use it whenever I have the opportunity. And yeah, like be sure to watch my video on my full review of this because this bag is something serious. It's like really, really nice. But 
Thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. Please share with me what's in your work bag. Is there anything you think I may need? Maybe like a bag organizer or some tools you could see me using that I may have left out. Let me know in the comments. I will see you guys next week with more content. Bye.